All right. Uh, as you may have guessed, this is the Creative Touch Fashion Machine 1036 again. You'll remember I'm having challenges with the feed. Uh, I messaged, I commented on um, Randy the Sewing Machine Guy, which I know I've linked before, uh, and he got back to me right away. Uh, and on the same front feed shaft as the feed gear, you'll see the eccentric uh, by the bushing support for the feed gear shaft. So that's this eccentric. Uh, in that eccentric is the timing line for the feeders, which I believe this is the timing line right here. When the needle rises to the bottom line on the needle bar and the point of the hook is behind the needle, so the needle bar is the bottom timing line. So the needle bar is all the way up. The hook should be around the back. The line needs to be in the middle of the shaped part on the eccentric. And the adjustment is this feed gear here, which I don't. Okay, there is a big line on the bottom of this eccentric here, of this cam. So maybe this line and that line are supposed to be lined up. Uh, let's try that and see if that is the secret. First, there's oh, and this is going to be that I have only have metric hex keys right now. Is there only? Yep, there's only one pin there. Okay, so we're gonna. Okay, the hook is directly behind where the needle would be. The needle appears to be up. We're going to rotate this around again. The line is very high. And the needle is, or the hook is right behind it. Okay. We're going to attempt to get the... this line here and this cast line on the back here to line up. So we'll try this again. Up. Huh. Interesting. So every time I rotate that around to this line up spot, this shaft is in a completely different spot. which is weird because that should be oh wait no it's not okay no it is coming out the right same space every time okay uh, let me find a way to loosen this cam or this screw on the end here and uh, try to adjust that. Okay, that timing advice from uh, Randy the sewing machine guy got me back to the feed dogs are up when the needle is up. 
when the feed dogs are down, when the needle is down. But if you watch carefully on this 1036, the feed dogs, and this is supposed to be set to a straight stitch, the longest possible stitch, uh, they moved this time they don't move and now they're gonna come up and they should move yep they move back and now they'll reset and this stitch is another stitch back and then this time they don't move and now they move back again so the cam link to reverse the stitches for the stretch stitches and stuff is somehow out of adjustment so that uh, I'm not getting full feed length travel of the dogs front to back and then on the plain stitches it is occasionally uh, not feeding fabric forward. So I don't know what to do about that. I've tried a few things. Yeah, I'm going to set this back on the shelf and think about it some more and maybe look around a bit. Um, I also may take the front cover off again and watch it while I turn it in the front cover to see if that reverse feed cam is doing anything weird when I look at it. Um, I'm also, I think, gonna... Yeah, I am i don't know yet. Uh, right now it's, you know, kind of frustrating. Uh, so I'm gonna set it aside and look at this again in a bit.